Hi, I'm Dave Bergman, Vice President of International Relations for IPC, and I have this week's IPC Technical Question of the Week. This week's question comes from an IPC member in Brazil, and it's related to soldering fluxes. And this member asks, uh, we need to know if there an IPC standard exists that defines the limit for salt in the flux for the process of printed board assemblies. So, uh, that what they're really looking for when they're defining a salt, they're looking for the halide content that's in the soldering flux. And the answer to this question is that this is addressed in uh, J standard 004, IPC J standard 004, requirement for soldering fluxes. And in this document, uh, the latest revision of uh, the 004 is uh, December 2008 in the B revision. Table 3.2 has the test requirements for soldering flux, and it indicates it has uh, quantitative halides, and it breaks it down into the three different activities. So uh, low, uh, a low activity flux, or L type, medium activity, or M type, and high activity, or H type. And so they have a, a uh, column in there which gives quantitative halide and uh, includes all halides, chlorine, bromine, fluorine, and iodine by weight. And in each category it gives limits. If it's low, there's categories uh, less than 0.05% and up through high greater than 2%. So the answer to our question, where do you find information on halide content for soldering fluxes? It's IPC J standard 004. That's this week's technical question of the week. If you'd like a question answered, please send it to answers at ipc.org.